I've got a little sneak preview for you today of a feature that is coming eventually in the Betaflight OSD. This is a build of 3.1. Uh, I don't know what build it is because someone sent me this copter. They configured it. Uh, I, so I can tell you anything more than that this exists. It is the ability to see your PIDs in the OSD while you're flying. You might ask, well, what the heck is that good for? I'll tell you what it's good for. It lets you use in-flight adjustments and still know exactly what the actual PID values are. So normally, you can either tune via the OSD while you're on the ground, but you have to land, right, and then take off again, and that takes forever. Or you can use in-flight adjustments to adjust the PIDs while you're flying, but then you don't know what the actual values are. Here is the best of both worlds. I'm super excited to see this feature make it into a final build. I've got one more tip, and this is more a tip for myself than a tip for you, but you can enjoy the mayhem that results from me not following this tip. When someone sends me a copter and they say it's ready to fly, uh, I should always check the board align and motor direction to be sure that it actually is correct, because it, if it's not, this is what happens. <laughs> and this is how I damaged a uh, Brother Hobby Returner motor on a copter that someone sent me for review. Bonk! Literally the first time I went to fly it. Oh well. Life goes on. Thanks for watching. Happy flying.